Now, last time we checked out Zero Trace, it was probably about, i say, two weeks ago. But, now we're actually taking a look at another physical product. Now, a few months back, Zero Trace reached out to me, and we checked out just the Zero Trace ESP32 packet injection tool. Now, this thing is beautiful, and I loved taking a look at it. And today, we're taking a look at another piece of hardware, and this one really sticks out in my collection. This is a BLE logger. I've never had a logger, especially, well, never had a key logger in the collection. I have a bunch of stuff, so I'm pretty excited about this. So here you can see it has two USB-C ports. We'll take a look at it in a minute. But it has this custom PCB that the ESP32 attaches to to get the USB. Now, before we get any further, this is our third partnership with Zero Trace. I'd just like to show my appreciation. So, of course, they have to go on the Zero Trace, or not Zero Trace, on the partnership wall. Now, you know you made a big when you're on Adventures of Ilias partnership wall. So, we have two options. I have some stickers right here. And, I mean, they're all right. But, I also got this keychain. So, I think we're going to toss some double-sided tape on here and stick this on the wall. So, here is the partnership wall. And, I mean, like I said, we could just toss a sticker on here, but I do think this will look way cooler. And it could go up here, or it could go right here. And I am feeling it more right there. So, boom. Just like that, Zero Trace is now part of the server. Thank you, guys, and let's get started with the actual device itself. Now, we just got on, well, you could see the screen, the actual web IP. So, this is 192.168.4.1. I know his was not... When I it was different, but this is the one that worked for mine. And we could just connect to the network itself. Okay, so now what's going to be happening from here is now that we're online, we could refresh this. But as you can see, I've got my BLE logger plugged in to the keyboard, which is connected here. And then that's connected all the way around to the server. So, I mean, let's check this out, see if it works. I mean, obviously, I'd... I would, I would think it would work after he's selling them. But let's see. So we have config. So this is the config script. So you can enter your scripts in here. So it has a few examples, flag settings, etc. And then you also have keywords to detect. Hmm. Why is this so high up? So that sounds interesting. If somebody's, like, talking about a certain subject, so you could say Ilya. And if somebody says Ilya, it'll let me know, and you can put the patterns in or whatever. So we could save the config. So it's saved successfully. File manager. This is just going to be where the files are. We could drop some new files in here if we want to. Calibration. So this is so we could calibrate the keyboard to see what keys we're on. Seems interesting. I know a bunch of them are different. Live view. So as we're typing, typing in K, it's saying K on here. So that's the calibrated key. So that is very cool. You're already just seeing that like that. I mean, it's like, what the heck? That's awesome. And then it'll show the keyboard writing over here. All of this stuff is kind of showing you what it's doing. Detection, detection events will appear here. And then you have your settings. So let's test this out. I'm pretty excited. Now, I interrupt you real quick to talk about Arc Labs. Yes, my store. And everything you see here is Arc Labs. And we got stuff from bug detectors to marauders, watches that could capture signals. The watches are going to be there. Pretty soon, uh, we just had our big drop. Check us out. I'll leave the link down in the description below. Uh, pretty cool shop. I mean, I'd go buy from them if I was you. Some cool stuff. Let's get back to the video. So, for example, the keyword is set to zero. So now that I typed in zero, we could go to detection. And detection, see, there it is. I don't know what this is about. <laughs> uh I was typing around things that may have been me, but detected zero. And that's going to help you find, obviously, your different stuff in here. And, I mean, it definitely is a cool little device. I mean, you plug this into somebody's thing, of course, you're going to do the same. IT, do not remove. Uh, I don't know if anybody still believes those anymore. My teacher at school definitely would. But, I mean, that's it for the zero trace. I mean, really, you're seeing the stuff coming in right now. So, it is a cool device. I have just scratched the surface with this. Um, it is a lot different. I've never had a device like this before. And I didn't really know what to expect. I still don't really know. Um, obviously, I could see what it is, what it does. But 
I'm still interested in learning like the different scripts you could have on here, especially with the uh, patterns to flag. Seems very interesting. But that is the Zero Trace BLE Logger. A pretty cool device, and you can get this right now on Zero Trace's website for about 56 bucks. They only have like a few left, and there's only 50 made. So go check it out, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.